Hello guys, Terminator9929 here, and you join us in the uh, auto show of uh, the original Forza Horizon. I know it's an old game, but you know, it's I, I personally think it's the best Forza they brought out. And I'm going to show you some cheap cars that you can do up and end up pretty good. So, uh, let's go into it. So, first of all, we start with the. Uh, uh, okay, take your Ford for example. Let's go for. Um, oh, that was quite expensive. Um, okay, we'll go for Honda. I'll do the bottom there, this is not fun. Alright, so we'll go for. Yeah, we'll go for that. Okay, we'll go for a Honda Civic Type R. 12,000 credits. Not too steep, would you say? No. Oh, I'm here with Dan, by the way, if you're wondering who the extra voice is. Hello, guys. He does have a YouTube channel, but he hasn't got anything on there. Some poor. Definitely gotta be in black. <laughs> yes. The sad thing is, it's true. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's return to free room. Yes, no. We'll go to the garage and I will show you how you can do this baby up. That sounded a bit dodgy. <laughs> I was talking about the car when I said do the baby up. <laughs> yeah, of course you was. I'm not Avery. Just to let you know, I wouldn't let Jordan Avery anywhere near your kids. <laughs> right, so now we need to go to the garage. Let's go. Tell me to turn around and it's there to do us all pushing their nose. Alright, so we are now at the garage. I want to custom upgrade my ride. <laughs> right, so we will start with. Ooh, what should we start with? Right, we'll start with the engine, I think. Ooh, okay, let's have a look at an engine swap. Right. We'll do that. Alright, and then we'll have a look at this. Let's have a look at this. Uh, we'll go for this. Right, so there I've done done up the engine. Right, we'll go for... Oh, what should we go for? We'll go for a race clutch system. Which increases the handling, acceleration, launching and braking. Which is always helpful. Now we go for the transmission. The sports transmission and you, uh, that, that increases speed quite a bit, we'll go for this one. Your drive line, you got your stock drive line, street drive line, sports drive line. This also reducts the weight by eleven point seven pounds, which is also helpful. And then we've got our uh, stock differentials, our sports differentials and our race differentials. Standards, your 1.5 way, your 2 way. This seems to decrease everything. No, it doesn't. And now we'll go for our brakes. Obviously, we need decent brakes. We won't go for rally suspension. We'll go for race springs dampers. Race spring dampers. Could people correct me on that? We'll go for a front anti roll bar. Rear, rear, race rear anti roll bar, can't even speak now. Uh, we won't go for one of these because it adds money. It adds money, adds weight, what the hell am I on about? And this takes off £390, which is quite a lot, if you're wondering. Now, we go on to the air filter. We'll go for a race intake, which increases the airflow, which makes obviously the car faster. We'll go for race fuel system as well, all good. Obviously we're going to go for race ignitions, which is basically spark plugs, your ignition leads and all that. We're going to go for a race exhaust, because why not? Might as well go for race cams and valves. Basically everything I'm doing is race. 
And now we need to go for. Oh, hello, that's new. We'll go for a race engine block, considering we're in a type R. Guess what? Race pistons. <laughs> you know what? Go for a race twin turbo. Hmm. And a race. Race into cooler. And we'll go for a race fly wheel as well. And now this is the biggest part, we go for the wheels and tyres. Tyres we go for race ones obviously. <laughs> obviously tyre width is important. We go for white tyres again. Right. The best tyres I find are what in a what well, if you say that? Because they reduce thirty one pounds and they also look rather quite nice. And if you go for wheel size you don't want that looks too stupid to be honest. And now we go for front bumpers. These aren't necessary, I just have them because why not? I'll go to the last one. I think we'll go for oh quite like that actually. We'll stick between them two. Look how much the thing goes up like. Yeah but it reduces the speed. Yeah, yeah. Uh I think we'll go for a Mugen because that is basically what Honda is. Now for the rear fin. Oh I'm not sure I like the Mugen one for that to be fair. Okay that looks stupid. Okay, I'm, go I'm actually going to stick with the Mugen again. Are we going for no, we can't go for Mugen this time. Right, the standard obviously looks a bit horrible. Hmm, Buddy Club, not sure. That looks too f f fat. Looks like we're going for this one. And now the skirts. I quite like them ones. Go for them ones. Now the hood. Now most of the stuff's Mugen, but that does look better. Right, that's everything done in here. Now we're going to go to the paint shop and make it look pretty. I mean, look how pretty that looks. I mean, it's going to look even prettier in a minute. So we best off get to the paint. Hmm. I might just go and have a look for some designs. This is where I spend most of my money doing cars off and putting designs on them. <laughs> Pocket out to level first, not doing too bad. We want designs for my car, obviously. Right, let's have a look. I could do that myself, so that's pointless. That looks quite nice, but I could do it myself again. Yeah, we'll through zero clicks. That actually looks quite nice, but again, I can do it myself. 
Oh. Can't do that yourself. Must be right there. I only like, I only normally like black window tint, but see, that's quite nice again. But that, let's have a look at this one. Something that you've something like that, but that's too much. A thousand. No, I mean like it's not too much credits. I mean it's too mu like too much. To, you, know, you know what I mean? Hmm. Oh, I'm not sure about this. I like the green, but I don't know. Nah. Most of the time I go for stupid ones, but uh, this time because of the car it's on, I think I'm going to go for one that looks appealing. Oh, as you can much be tell, I'm a Honda fan. Well, fast jack cars, Hondas, Nissans, stuff like that. That's why it's going to look nice. <laughs> So, uh, in the comments, comment comment what car you want me to buy next and do up and put a design on it. Don't mind what car it is. Well, obviously, if it's a expensive car, I'll have to do a couple more races to get some more money, but, you know. Nah. And don't forget to like and subscribe. If you're new around here, obviously, hopefully, hopefully, if I, when I get to 100 subscribers, I'll do a thank you video. So, but I've got a long way to go because I ain't got any subscribers at the minute. <laughs> Poor me. I like the title though, uh, JDM. It's not, if you don't know what a uh, JDM is, it is a sporting event for all Japanese cars that goes on at Silverstone. It's uh, actually uh, this weekend, which is quite fun. Ooh. Hmm. I'm not sure about that now, actually. Nice, but whether it's uh, fifty thousand credits, nice. No. Thirteen people that way. Mm -hmm. It's like fucking. Ooh. Some of these are not. Mm -hmm. Uh, 
we all got two million credits, so you know. Yeah, but still. Um, sure. I'm not sure. Let's have a look at this one. You know what, guys? I'm going to get it. That's okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Are you sure you want to purchase this? I'm not going to try and wait. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. That is it for this video, guys. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment what you want, what car you want me to buy next, and uh, hopefully this YouTube channel actually takes off. Peace out.